All right, so I'm going to walk you through calibrating the ESCs and showing how it still won't harm afterwards. Just uh, for reference, here's what I get when I try and connect with the wireless radio to the Pixhawk unit. And it just says parameter index number, number, number now, and it used to say the names, but I'm told that this is normal. So we're connected. And see the Oz moving when I move the copter around, so we're connected. First of all, I'm going to put the camera down, show it at the screen. Go to initial setup, radio calibration, and calibrate my radio. I'm using my DX6i here, which is normally my camera radio, but I thought maybe I was having problems with Tenaris. Following the prompts, calibrating my radio. And we got through all that. Click when done. Okay. Now I'm going to put the throttle to full throttle. Remove power from my Pixhawk unit for a second. Put it back in. See the three flashing LEDs, so remove it. Put it back in. Get the buzz for the, it's ready to go into ESC calibration mode. Plug in my ESCs to the main power. Oh, I forgot to mention, I've got a brand new ESC with a brand new motor, never been used, so it's not that these ESCs or motors are damaged or anything. Hold the button down, get the double click, get the six tunes showing that the calibration was successful, give it some throttle, motors all spin up exactly together, leaving the throttle at minimum throttle, I will unplug my ESC power and unplug the Pixox power. I'll wait uh, the 10 seconds or whatever it says to wait to make sure it's not in ESC calibration mode anymore. Plug the Pixhawk back in. We get the lovely noises. Let's see if we're still connected to the telemetry. Sometimes it doesn't really lose connection when you turn it on and off. No, we've lost connection, so we'll disconnect and reconnect again. Waiting for it to connect, waiting for it to connect. And I waited for it to connect because I'm going to show you it's going to stay armed, but the motors aren't going to spin. All right. You can see we're connected, it's disarmed, there's no errors. Move the R around. Okay, so. Don't have any air LEDs on here. I'm going to hold the safety button. Oh, I forgot to plug my ESCs in. First, I'm going to plug my ESCs in. I'm going to hold the safety button. Got a solid light there. Give it down and right throttle. And get the arm tone. It says armed on the screen, the motors will not spin. Throttle up, down, up, down, up, down, nothing. We already demonstrated that the motors work. I didn't change anything on the radio. The radio is calibrated. You'll see that it's receiving signals from the radio still. Oh, it disarmed itself because it thinks the throttle is at minimum, which it is. You can see the throttle is receiving, giving the signals it should. So I don't I don't know what else to say.